rolling fluid circulation in oil and gas well is like blood circulation in human body. If our body organs don't work properly to screen out impurities from blood, it will result in severe skin, heart, arteries and other diseases. Same is the case with the drilling fluid. The drilling fluid carry so many impurities and contaminants which enter into the drilling fluid while drilling the formation. If contaminants are not removed, they will disturb the mud properties like yield point, plastic viscosity and filtrate loss that will result in high drag, high pressure, thick mud cake and eventually stuck pipe. Pipe stuck may result in huge economical loss. Please subscribe and press bell icon to receive more videos. A contaminant is any material or substance that causes undesirable effect on mud properties. A mud is said to be contaminated when a foreign material enters into the mud system and causes undesirable changes in the mud rheology like density, viscosity and filtration. Mud contamination can result from over treatment of the mud system with additives or from material entering into the mud during drilling process. While much of the drill solid are inert, there are certain material which can cause severe problem with drilling fluid properties with corrosion and effect on these will depend on how quickly contaminant enters into the drilling fluid. We should have frequent check on the mud system and if we find any contaminant inside the mud system we should treat that contamination immediately to avoid any adverse effect on the drilling fluid. Advanced treatment to prevent the contamination Advanced treatment to prevent the contaminants affecting the drilling fluid can sometimes be made, for example, on the basis of the geological prognosis or when drilling out cement. With the majority of the water-based drilling fluids, the contaminants will tend to affect the clay particle mostly. For salt contamination, salt contamination can come from drilling salt beds or from formation water in flux. It can be detected by increase in chlorides in the mud. The electrolyte effect tends to flocculate the clay with N plus replacing with hydrogen plus ion in the clay. The salt contamination will decrease pH value whereas viscosity, gel strength and fluid loss will increase. For severe salt contamination we have two options. Either we need to have dilution and building the new drilling fluid and another thing is we can convert the mud to the salt water or a salt saturated drilling fluid because the chloride contents are salt Contamination will no more affect the salt saturated drilling fluid. Cement contamination The cement contamination entering into the drilling fluid when drilling out the cement. Calcium hydroxide is formed due to the cement contamination and severe flocculation of the clay contained in the drilling fluid is observed. The contamination is cured by use of soda ash or sodium bicarbonate. The sodium bicarbonate is preferred to soda ash if low pH is required. For drilling out a hard cement plug or shoe track, a pretreatment of 5 to 6 sacks of sodium bicarbonate should be used to guard against the contamination. If green or very soft cement has to be drilled or circulated out, the contamination may be too severe 
to cure and contaminated drilling fluid should be discarded at surface calcium contamination calcium contamination due to various reasons the calcium ions may become sufficiently concentrated to flocculate the drilling fluid as calcium ions replaces the sodium ions in the clay the clay particles tend to aggregate the result of the contamination is an increase in the calcium ion concentration will increase in the fluid loss yield point and gel strength calcium ions may enter into the mud system from different sources like gypsum and hydride cement lime sea water hard make up water the treatment of calcium ions contaminants depends on the source of calcium ion for example sodium carbonate that is soda ash is used if source is from gypsum or anhydrite sodium bicarbonate is preferred treatment if calcium ion is from lime or cement if treatment become economically unacceptable break over mud to a mud system such as gypsum mud or lime mud that can tolerate calcium ions contamination contamination is not usually a problem with gypsum drilling fluid calcium ion contamination and gypsum drilling fluid are good friend they don't bother each other carbonate bicarbonate contamination in unclean drilling fluid a carbon dioxide influx can form bicarbonate or carbonate ions our treatment of contaminants with soda ash or sodium bicarbonate can also contribute to a problem known as carbonate alkalinity in practice this result in an inability of lignosulfate to treat high yield point and gel strength if it is suspected that carbonate bicarbonate contamination is taking place in the drilling fluid the system should always first be treated with caustic if this treatment with caustic is not effective then soluble calcium ions may be introduced in the form of lime however this should be done with utmost care to avoid flocculating the drilling fluid clay the lime should be added to the system stepwise such that each addition produces no more than 10 ppm increase in filtrate hardness if possible a pilot test should be performed before treating a system as a whole active clay during drilling active clay will tend to build up collided solid in the drilling fluid and cause high viscosities and gels and often give a thick filter cake clay inhibitors such as calcium chloride may be used to reduce the effect of swelling clay foaming several drilling fluid additives such as lignosulfates polymers etc can cause foaming particularly when a large batch of drilling fluid is prepared the foam can be easily reduced by adding aluminium tricitrate to a bucket of diesel oil and mixing this into the drilling fluid as an alternative the liquid deformers can also be used gas getting when a large quantity of gas enters into the drilling fluid the drilling fluid will have a reduced density on surface generally the gasser can easily remove the gas but only gas free drilling fluid should be pumped down the hole we are providing drilling rig online courses these online courses you can access with your tablet laptop or mobile the feature of these online courses are that these courses are online very cheap economically discount coupon codes are available on request once you purchase online course you will have access lifetime you will get certificate on completion of any online course there is 30 days guarantee money back in case if you want to refund your money the beauty of these online courses is that we have experienced instructor who have 
12 years experience in oil and gas ruling sector. So you will have information in hand in very short time.